Hi, my name is Patty, and I'm a part, no, I'm a full-time reseller on Poshmark, Macari, and eBay. And this is my very first haul video. I'm really excited to share this with you. I'm inspired on YouTube by people like Jack and Ryan, Lori's Boston Founds, Courtney at Common Goods, um, Hope, I'm trying to think of what Hope's YouTube pages, but you know what, I'll link it down below. And um, Kelly Schaffner, I love her too. Always so much fun to watch all these people, and also Michelle and Jean, the bin pickers, always inspire me every day when I watch theirs, and I just thought, you know what, it's time for me to do a YouTube video and share my haul with you. And so, let's start. I didn't want to do too many things. Let's start with some hard goods. I'm joined here by Gracie. Say hello, Gracie. I am Gracie's nanny. Her dad is a chef, and he's fabulous. So we keep Gracie a few days a week while he is off chefing. Um... This is one of the first things I found. I thought this is super cool. When I go into the, the Goodwill, my Goodwill has the purses when you first walk in, but then there's another part in the back that has the totes. And this, I always find some really cool things back in the totes. This was back there. It is a Bobbi Brown makeup case. It is so cool. It's got zippers on the side and it has a magnetic magnetic opening and I don't think it's ever been used it looks brand spanking new and I'm finding comps on online for about 60 bucks so I'm hoping to get about 50 bucks 50 dollars for it it looks like I mean it's in pristine condition there's the bottom oh there is a little mark right there but nothing nothing right about it I'll probably get that off and let's see here's a pair of shoes these are Cole Haan collab with Nike Air. Some cute little uh, sandals in gorgeous condition. Look like they haven't been worn. Let's put them together so you can see them correctly. And I'll show you the bottom. In, in perfect condition. So maybe I'll start that at 60 and hope to get 50 or 45 for it. And here are some, you know, Crocs are back. Apparently Crocs are back. Here's a pair of Crocs. They're a size women's 10, which is a shame because they look fun. They're too big for me and in pristine condition. They retail brand new for about 40. So I'm gonna probably start them at 35 and hope to get at least 25 for them. Last pair of shoes. Y'all be kind, this is the first video, or a pair of Steve Madden. Can you see that? And they are so fun. They're called the granite shoe. And the granite is spelled with two with two eyes. And all of the, the studs and all of the rhinestones are all in place. Not, not one missing. It has been worn. People, it's been worn a few times. They're, they've been loved. But that's okay. They're still in amazing condition. And I think they'll probably go for, I'm hoping, 30. And you know, not every time is going to be a... A home run. <laughs> I found this and I thought, this is so cool. No one else is going to have this. Don't worry. Beyonce. Cute. It has a little flip um, latch. It's a little wallet. Brand new. Looks like it's never been used. So I went on. I didn't even check the comps on this because I just thought it was super, super cool. I bought it for $3. And uh, it's selling on Poshmark for just that three dollars so I think instead of selling it I think what I'm gonna do is make it a gift with purchase maybe a gift with purchase with that Bobby Brown so let me know if you want that Bobby Brown bag and you get your own very own don't worry Beyonce wallet so let's get on to some clothes <sighs> thank goodness for all of our people here on YouTube I have learned so much about what to pick up and what not to pick up so if you're new to this as well Please watch them. Oh, also, I like a rural squirrel. She's really cute. She lives up in, I think, Colorado, and she goes all over camping and going to bins. This is Show Me Your Moo Moo. You knew this. And it's a cool, cool blouse. It's either a blouse, you can use it with a blouse, or as a kimono. It's got these gorgeous, where are they? These gorgeous mother of pearl buttons. Can you see those? Here, let me see. They're showing up. There they are. So, so pretty. Looks brand new. But it's, what a gorgeous piece this is. I love it. Super light, so you can just layer it over another piece or wear it as well. You do you. Now, when I was a kid, Laura Ashley was all the thing. 
and I believe this is a vintage Laura Ashley. I want to say probably from the 80s. It's a wrap dress. Here's the label. It's a size US 6. But it is light, light, light. It's so pretty. It's a wrap, beautiful floral dress. It's super long though. So for all you tall, thin girls out there, they're a size 6. Give me a call. Get in touch. I'll hook you up. Here, you know, sometimes you just buy things for, for style, not for the brand. I thought this was super cute. It's a precious little romper. You can wear it on the shoulders, off the shoulders, you know, make it your own. It's Rue 21. So I'll probably start it at 30 and hope to get 20 for it. I think I'll get 20 for it. I think that's going to be a, oh, it also has pockets. Pockets are always the thing, right? You always want pockets in your clothes. The less things you have to carry, the better. Although I do like a nice handbag. I do. Yeah, you know, sometimes I've gotten handbags at the Goodwill. I bought a Tory Burch that I love so much that I just couldn't part with it. Tell me if you do that too. I'd love to know. Let me know in the comments. This is so pretty. And I'm glad I, I started this video and it didn't work out quite right. So I had to move to another room. I love this. Look at that yellow color. It's that Pantone yellow color of the year. And this is from Lulu's. Look at that. It's called the Near and Bar Dress, which I think is so cute. And it's got this, it's a mini. It's a size small. This cute little keyhole back. No, no pockets. No pockets on this one. So I think with this one, I'm probably going to, ah, it's hard. It comps with Lulu's are all over the place. So I think what I'm going to do is list it at 50 and hopefully we'll get 35 for it. Maybe 30. Here is another Show Me Your Moo Moo. The Show Me Your Moo Moo gods were smiling down on me on this day. And there's the tag. This weighs zero. It is so light. It's a size small, honestly. If you're size small, you can probably fit two of you in there. It is super sheer with that beautiful paisley. It's maroon and teal. Ugh, so pretty. It's going to be so perfect for summer. You could layer it. You could even use that as a, um, a like a beach cover-up. The same thing with the other one, too. I love a preppy anything. So J. Crew is my is kind of my wheelhouse. This is a little J. Crew. It's it's like a um a screen print crab. How cute is this? I love it. It's super soft. It's a size medium, and it also has the J. Crew on the back too, which is unusual. Usually it's just on the inside, but super cute. Maybe get fifteen for it. We'll see. I saw this. This was in with the. <laughs> This was in with the men's shirts. I don't know. I don't have an answer, but I knew what it was. It's Bowden. You knew too, didn't you? Here's Bowden. Size eight. Look at how fun this is. It, it looks like a wrap, but it's not. Look at those cute flamingos. Love. And it, honestly, it looks like it's never been worn. It looks brand new. Oh, um, probably put it up for 40. Hope to get 30, 35. But someone's gonna love that. It's super fun. This really maybe would be better in the in the fall, but I just I couldn't leave it. I couldn't leave it there. It is a J. Crew, and it is a it's called a crinkle dress. Here, can you see that? There you go. And all of the ones, all the comps I saw online, which is so weird, all had the mark through the the label, just like mine. So I'm not sure what the deal was there. But it's super pretty. It's got pockets. It's a Dupiani linen. So it's linen, linen and nylon. So pretty. It has a little side zip as well. How are we doing, Gracie? You doing okay? She looks like she's doing okay. This was a brand I had, or a designer I did not know, I, but it looks so beautiful and so quality, I had to pick it up. It's Comtoir. De Contenaires. I'm hoping I'm saying that correctly. It's just a little black shift dress. How do you all do this? I'm going to learn how to do this. To hold the, the clothes like this. So pretty. It's got a, like a super stretchy material. And it has this gorgeous Swiss dot detailing. I think it's so, so pretty. Got little front pockets. The comps with this were kind of all over the all over the place. It looks like it retails for close to 300. So I think what I'm going to do is start it at 60 and hope for 40. And we all know 
it's so fantastic to find things that are newer tags. Sometimes you find things that are newer tags and they're just, I just leave them there because I know it's not going to sell. Why would I pick up something that's not going to sell? I'm sure you feel the same way. Let me know if you just leave things behind sometimes too because they're just not going to sell, even if they're newer tags. This is Loft. It's a size 10 and it's this gorgeous, look at this beautiful floral eyelid. Oh, I just love it. If I waited till I was a size 10, I might be really super old, so I'm going to sell it. Let's see. Next, another one of my loves, J. Crew. Again, I've sworn in my journey, I'm going to start becoming a J. Crew expert because I want to learn about all the styles. I just love selling it. I know some people think it's not a, a great seller, but it's been selling pretty well for me, especially the blazers. Tell me how you do with J. Crew. I love this. It's called the um, Thistle Popover. That pretty little floral detail. I'm slipping off the slipping off the bed here. And you know, I like shirts. I like cereal. How about shirts with cereal on it? Fruit Loops, so fun. And it's by the brand Nutter. Never heard of it. Doesn't matter. I like a kitschy thing. I think someone's gonna like this. I'll start it at 50 and see if I can get 30 for it. This is a streetwear brand called Vox Populi for the people. I thought this was super cool with the stripes. It's a, everything on it looks <laughs> a little asymmetrical, including this Brooklyn on the front. It's, it's rubber. It's really cool. But I don't think they retail for a ton, so I think maybe I'll start it at 30 and hope to get 20 for it. And along with my pet things of all things preppy that I love is this precious look how cute this is it is a little top with pink plaid look at these cute little pom-poms they're pom-poms on the sleeves and they're pom-poms on the bottom and it is by Haley and the Hound this was a new to me brand I couldn't believe I didn't know about this because I think it's the cutest thing ever another one of those things where you can wear it off the shoulder or on the shoulder It'll probably look best off the shoulder so don't love a thing I have to wear a strapless bra with. Tell me if you feel the same way. Before the season gets too warm, I wanted to put out this stunning, oh, this is so beautiful. It's cream and black polka dot cashmere pullover sweater from Saks Fifth Avenue. Look at this beautiful detailing on the back. Just a sweet, three little buttons. It's in gorgeous condition. It's tough sometimes with cashmere. I know that you know, you have to really look it over carefully because there's almost always you're always going to find a hole, a, a hole, a hole in it. Um, but that didn't have any holes in it, so score. This was a new brand to me as well. Another street brand. So cute. Look how cute this is. It's from the brand Surreal. And I'm feeling it. So the, the, um, Print is called Starburst, Starburst Camo. Say that three times fast. So, but it's a little dress. It's not overalls. I mean, it's an overall dress, but it's a dress. With these cute little pockets on the side. It is a size... Let's see, So Real, where are you? So Real, size medium. There it is. And it's got... It does have elastic in the back. But man, it's... It's made for a... A little slim person who's gonna look adorable in it rocking it for the summer with a little tank top maybe like a little tube top underneath would be super cute love this always need a little bling in your wardrobe Carl Lagerfeld Paris it is a size small I love all that detail that ribbon detail on the book in the inside of it with Carl's signature on the back I don't know about this I, I think maybe I'll list it for 30 and hope to get 20 for it. Here is a shirt from Express. This is the Portofino shirt, which I've heard lots of um, YouTubers say is like a really desirable shirt. I love that little anchor print. Cute, cute, cutie patootie. Um, but it looks like the comps. They're maybe going for like $20. So I'll list it at 25, 28 and hope to get 20 for it. I still haven't quite figured out where to look on my camera, so bear with me. I'm going to get better at this, I promise. 
Guess who? J. Crew. Hey, that rhymes. This is the floral popover, the voile um, floral popover, V O I L E. And it weighs nothing. It's so light and so pretty. I love all the, the, the stitching detail here. It's just gorgeous. So pretty. Someone's going to love it. Size four. Probably list it for 30 and hope to get 20, 25 for it. And the darling of Poshmark. Everybody loves Madewell. I think there was a show about that. Madewell, size two. It is the intricate embroidered dress. Look at this. The embroidery. It's so, so pretty. It's got the little tassels on it. It is a size two, so. But people that are size two, they need a they need a beautiful dress as well. Pockets, because everybody needs pockets. Put your little lip gloss in there, your keys and your ID, some money, your credit card. You're good to go. And oh gosh, y'all, our time is just about over. I have kept you for long enough. And thank you for if you're staying on, if you're still here, God bless you. Um, this is by anthropology, this is one of those things I've got to get listed right away because it is big and it is chunky. Chunky. I love it. Just a big open cardigan. I love this pink. And it's got these balloon sleeves. See that? They're real big and puffy. They're super cool. And I'll probably start this, I'm thinking probably 60 and hope to get 35 at least for it. You guys, Thank you so much for joining me. If you hung in here, you are a trooper. And um, I'll get better, I promise. And um, let me know what you think in the comments. But please be kind. And I appreciate you being here. And I'll see you next time. Bye.